So what's up guys, welcome back again to the channel All The Parfum. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And while you're at it, please give us a thumbs up for this video. So for today's episode, unboxing and first impression ever for me. For this fragrance right here, this is Kismet Angel by Maison Alhambra. Maison Alhambra, this company is under the wing of Latafa Fragrances. A UAE based company and as you guys already know Maison Alhambra is specialized in like doing clones or inspirations of other designer or niche uh, fragrances so yes without further ado let's unbox uh, this one uh, live on video for you guys and uh, check it out try it out and see how it is I heard I heard many things about this fragrance I heard nothing but good things about this fragrance and uh, the main thing uh, is that it is a clone of Angel's Share by Killian and you, as, uh, as you guys already know that fragrance is a bit on the expensive side while this one is a much much cheaper alternative as some people said I haven't tried it yet but I'm gonna try it now and see all about it. But first of all, let's do like a presentation of the box and the bottle and show you uh, a close close up of the box and everything else. So as you guys can see, it comes, I mean, the fragrance comes in this type of box. It screams class. I like this type of uh, boxes. It gives it more, uh, gives the fragrance more character, more charm. Over here, it says Eau de Parfum. Over here, the name of the fragrance, Kismet Angel. Over here we have the name, the name and the logo of Maison Alhambra. Uh, on the back also we have once again the logo of Maison Alhambra. We have the stamp for the authentication, uh, some information, ingredients, etc. Over here once again we have the name of the fragrance, and on the bottom I believe we have yes the batch code right here, and uh, the production date and expiration date barcode and the, the Latafa website so yes moment of truth let's check the bottle out so yes -da! as you guys as you guys can see it comes in a yeah it's kind of like angels share when it comes to the the way or design of the box kind of if i can say that but when it comes to the bottle it is a little bit different and uh, as you guys can see this is the bottle this is the bottle and it's, uh, well, it says 100 ml, but uh, it looks a little bit uh, on the smaller size, but if they say 100 ml, then uh, I believe them. Anyways, so yes, as I said, uh, the bottle doesn't really look as much as a beautiful or as charming as the one for Angel's share, but when it comes to the presentation, it is pretty decent. And uh, yeah, I, I kind of like the color of the, I mean, with the, with the gold, but the color of the juice, mm, I'm not really a, a big fan. Anyways, we have the name of the fragrance right here. Let's check uh, the bottom. We have the sticker right here. It says Alhambra. And uh, yeah, let's spray a little bit. The cap is tight. Very nice. Let's spray a little bit of this fragrance. Let's see about the sprayer, by the way. Looks like a decent sprayer. Let's spray it once again for the camera. Yeah, very nice. Okay, nice sprayer. I'm not gonna say very nice. And uh, I haven't sniffed my hand yet, and I can tell. I can tell that this is a strong perfume, like for reals. Wow, I'm sniffing my hand right now. I'm not even close to it. It's pretty strong. It's not. It's not super alcoholic. It is actually a little bit smoother than what I expected, but it comes really spicy, warm spicy, fresh spicy, and very sweet. But this is definitely a strong scent. I'm really trying to not really sniff it too, uh, like, uh, too uh, heavily. And it is definitely a heavy, uh, dense type of uh, eau de parfum. I can even call it this is an extra de parfum. It has that. It has that vibe, if you know what I mean. It has that density. The opening is not really um, well. In my book, the opening is not really that pleasing. It's not really something I can say crowd pleasing. It does have this like sort of niche 
character to it as it is definitely it smells a little bit different but it is super I'm trying to not say uh, a word that's gonna get me well I think this is this might be the strongest lot of a fragrance that I I mean the Maison Alhambra fragrance that I tried so far maybe even uh, the strongest lot of a fragrance or the strongest opening when it comes to the opening it's not like a glowing type of uh, opening it's not really that chemical or uh, like disturbing or it's gonna put you uncomfortable but it is really strong ultra spicy very aromatic it has a uh, yeah kind of woodsy you can feel some woodsy notes here maybe but the sweetness with the spiciness is I mean the mix makes it a little bit a little bit overwhelming Mm, and if there is any resemblance with Angel's Share, it is kind of starting to have that vibe like Angel's Share, but it is not, I mean, the opinion, it is uh, slightly different. I can say, yes, uh, this one, like 50% similar when it comes to opinion, similar to Angel's Share, but there is some differences. This is more Middle Eastern oriented. It has that Middle Eastern vibe that's very obvious from the beginning and as I said it's not cloning it's not disturbing it's not really uh, like uh, some other Latafa fragrances but it's much more smoother but at the same time powerful and it gives the impression that this fragrance might be a really strong strong and I bet it's gonna be really really long-lasting with a powerful sillage and projection but uh, I will have to like definitely try to wear it a few times to see how it's gonna really perform and how it's gonna develop and uh, right now as I'm speaking I can feel some changes changes when it comes to the scent uh, there is some sort of uh, juicy vanilla accords with a little bit of cinnamon as well so yeah this fragrance is def has definitely more to say and uh, yeah I don't want to rush any decision of how much it smells like angels share I will try to do the comparison as well in the next videos uh, so yes definitely guys stay tuned for uh, the, the full review for this uh, fragrance right here this, this is Kismet Angel by Maison à la Ambra by La Tafa and uh, yeah give us a, a thumbs up for this video and definitely stay tuned for the next videos take care bye